And we're following up tonight, Lawrence District 55 High School and Piedmont Technical College rolling out a new ambulance simulator. This is part of their EMT training program for seniors. We first told you about this last month. Now students can get a feel for what it's like to working in an ambulance at their own school. Fox Carolina's Jarvis Robertson stopped by the school today and shows us how this will help fill a critical need in the workforce. It brings it so much more reality. Which will benefit these seniors in the EMT program as they get closer to graduating. So far, they've only been in the traditional school setting. You don't realize how much room you have until you are in the back of a simulator and you realize, like, this is what we're working with. And having the ambulance simulator here at Lawrence High School takes the students' classroom experience to a new level. Essentially, they're getting on-the-job training without being on the job. Program instructor Steve Hudson says the simulator will allow students to carry out 911 calls from start to finish, learning how to make medically sound decisions in a setting comparable to the environment EMTs currently work in will give students advantages when they're ready to enter the work field. I've been in EMS since about 1994 and we've tried to recreate the back of an ambulance in a classroom and it just isn't realistic. It makes me feel like we're finally getting to where we are getting more opportunities and I'm finally going to be able to experience more because it's what I want to do. It makes me feel um, like I'm helping. The state has seen a lack of EMT workers in recent years. Lawrence County has worked to fix that problem, but it was tough getting positions filled. It impacts the community when you have shut trucks down and don't have the ambulances to respond. These students will be able to go directly into the workforce after graduation. Jarvis Roberts.